We're going to talk about the hand tool in Illustrator. It's something pretty basic and something I take for granted, but as a beginner, you might not know how to navigate your document. This is not about how to save as a PDF. This is just a document open of a thumbnail that I had. Now, the H key, if you press it on your keyboard, gives you the hand tool and your cursor changes to a hand. Then we can click and drag our document around to just navigate around it without worrying about accidentally moving anything. This simply changes your camera's view as you navigate around your different designs and find your different elements. This combined with zooming in and out, command or control plus and minus, allows you to quickly move around your document, find different elements to go and edit, and then make your adjustments. But the hand tool does not have to be selected to actually use it. So you don't have to press H. In fact, I've never pressed H on my keyboard. What I do press, if I have any other tool open, is the space bar. If you press and hold the space bar while you have it held is the hand tool. And so I can press and hold space bar to move around and then go back to doing whatever I was doing with whatever tool I had without going and reselecting that tool. So holding space bar allows you to move around your document with ease. And this is what professionals do. This should be one of the first things that they teach you on navigating your designs. If I mean, whomever your teacher is, and if it's me, I hope that you're able to understand and you're able to utilize Spacebar now and basically just keep your thumb on it no matter what you're doing. And also, this is pretty universal. So the Spacebar will navigate you around multiple different design software. So it's definitely one to memorize. And that's how you can use the hand tool really quickly here in Illustrator.